What's going on everyone? My name is Glorious Mischief. Welcome back to another episode of Cuphead and today we are going all the way to aisle four into the pit of the Cassini. We're going back to where it all began, back at the Cassini, where we first struck a deal with a very unsavory individual. Oh, I am very excited for this episode. It is probably going to be one of the more annoying ones because this fight, it doesn't mess around, man. The fight with the, with the, um, <laughs> sorry, I had to get the secret gold coin. Um, the fight with the, uh, with both of these individuals is tough. Let's check our weapon. We've got chaser and roundabout. I'm fine with that for right now. We're gonna give it a try. Oh, King Dice. Ready to roll? It's gonna be a problem. Um, well, looky here. You actually pulled it off, but you've made me lose a bet. And for that, you ain't seeing the boss just yet. We're gonna play a little game first. Here we go. So, um... You have to smack the dice to get to the right one. And just full transparency, um, there are definitely easier ones than, than some of the other ones. So some of the bosses are drastically easier to beat than other bosses. Um, I like to go two if I can. Um, let's see. Ready? Oh, I went three. <laughs> My parry was off. Three is still fine. Um, I think it's the cigar? Two is the poker chips, which is really nice. The poker chips are super easy. Um, clearly my parries are a little off. That's all right. Cigar! And just shim over here. And shim over here. Woo! And we're through, baby! So all you gotta do is just dodge. Um, his little fireys, which are pretty easy to dodge. And then when his, uh, when he comes over this way, you just dash over here. Smoke Bomb, I think, is the most crucial thing that you can have in this fight. If you ask me. Or in all the fights, basically. All of King Dice fights. Um, Smoke Bomb just makes everything so much easier. So if you're having trouble with King Dice, Smoke Bomb is clutch. See how easy that was? Like, the easiest thing you possibly could do. Um, these first bosses are really not that hard, but some of the other ones get tough. Let's see. Because you can skip some of them. Um, I don't know if I really need to get to skips, though. We'll see. Because... Yeah. Yeah, it's safe. So if I go to safe, then I'm good. Um, I might go straight to five, though. If I can get one, two, three. Um, gotta try my bounces. There we go. An extra heart! Um, I'm pretty sure this is the rabbit? Is it the rabbit? Rabbit? Is it you, rabbit man? <laughs> I think it is. We'll see. Yeah, it is. Um, we can just burn this real quick, because why not? And then we'll just turn around and start dealing with this. Ooh, got a parry. Oh, how did I not parry? How did I not parry? Smoke bomb! I don't like getting hit on the bunny. Parries! There we go. And the smoke bomb through. Easy as could be. Ooh. Parries. You love to see it. Ready to smoke bomb? Dash. Perfect. Yeah, he's not hard, the bunny. <laughs> uh, you can get through these guys super quick. I did take a damage, though, which is not great. I'm at three, so three's not the worst thing in the world. Three health. I'd like to get... I have beaten King Dice going through every single boss, going, um, every single mini boss, and then going through, um, and getting, like, a bunch of all the health that I possibly can. Ooh, I might go two. Two to get to the eight, because eight's what I want to get to. And ready? Nope. Ooh. 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 Oh, man, I am timing this all kinds of wrong. Oh, come on! Give me two! Oh, I got three! That's not what I wanted. Um, that's Poker Chip Girl. Poker Chip Girl is a little bit difficult. But I think we can get through it. I think we can get through it. We shouldn't have that much of an issue. How am I this bad at the dice, though? That's the question. <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm beating the bosses, having a hard time with the dice. <laughs> Woo! Gotta get through. Woo! Smoke Bomb is so good. I love Smoke Bomb. It's literally the best. 
Um, oh, 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 gotta watch out and dash through and then come back up. I love that she's a roulette table. Woo! And we're through and we're dodging. And send those back over to her. And we're through. I love this boss, though. All of the bosses in King Dice are really fun. Um, wow, super easy. Once again, the amount of health that they have is just a delight. It's like such a little breeze to get through. Um, and they've got like very little health. Um, yeah. So far, so good. On the King Dice run. But the mini bosses aren't hard. Um, alright, if I can get a three and then two, we're done. Then we got mini, oh, we got, um, King Dice then. Three, 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 three. Oh, I got a one. <laughs> At least it's the easiest, and one of the easier bosses. Um, and we got an extra health, which I'm not complaining about. Man, my parries are awful today. Um, you can just smack him down with this, or this. Uh, he just does this every once in a while, and then these guys come in from the sides. You just kind of go, let them go over you. It's about as easy as it gets. And Cuphead. And come on through. I could, par I could ult him, but I feel like I should save that for King Dice. Um, because King Dice is kind of a problem. And see how easy this one is? There's a little scoosh. Just a little tiny scoosh. <laughs> I can't parry, but I can beat the bosses. <laughs> Whoops! Um, right, that's the last one that I want to fight, if I can avoid it. I don't want to start over. Um... So I need a... is it two and two? Yeah, I need a two and a two. All right, come on, two and two. Two, 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 yeah! All right, now we're getting there. Oh, that's right. Two, 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 two! Here we go, ready? Here he comes, he's hard. Woo! Oh, got hit. Oh, I should, I should, um, ult King Dice. Ulting King Dice. And jumping, and jumping, and jumping. Ooh, I needed to give it more time. I'm being impatient. That's what I'm being. All right, ready? Oh, how did I get hit with that? Oh! Rude! All right, we got this one. Ooh, I'll do a three to start. I'll do a three to start if I can actually hit my dice correctly. Three, 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 three. <gasps> Yay, we're doing things correctly. <laughs> King Dice is kicking my butt today. I don't appreciate what he's doing. I don't really, I'm not picking up what he's putting down, that, that Jerkosaurus. All right, here we go. Ready? And we shabble. And we shabble. It's really when he does the threes that's, that he's the most annoying. Um, but yeah, you can see how good Smoke Dash is against all of these mini bosses. Um, they're, I mean, Smoke Dash, I think, is the best ability in the game. But um, if you disagree, let me know, because I don't think that there is anything better, but I've been fooled before. And Cuphead is also kind of like a subjective game where, like, there's things that work better for different people, you know? Also, that's the entire methodology of these boss rush games. That if there's something that works for you, and you're crushing it, and you've, like, mastered that ability, do it, dude. Use that ability as much as you can. There's absolutely no reason why you should ever listen to someone and be like, this is the best strat in, like, a, a boss rush game, or, like, a FromSoft or Dark Souls game, or any difficult game. Uh, if you don't have, like, experience with it, dude, it's not worth it. Ooh, let's get a two, if we can. Two, 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 or one. One is fine. We can one it up again. One is fine. One. One, 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 one. Oh, I keep messing up. One, 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 one. Yes. We're at five health. That is delightful. I love five health. Um... That being said, this boss can be a little trickster, so you have to be careful. This is the dominoes? Are they dominoes? I think they're dominoes. 
Yeah, they're dumb. And you just kind of have to be careful with her. Because she can be a trickster. But we can smack her up as much as we want to, which is nice. Ooh, she's got the pinks. Oh, how did I get hit by the pinks? I was trying to parry the pink. And instead I got hit by it. Ooh, she's throwing out her little duck domino. Ducky domino. Oh! Okay. 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 Perfect. Um, you can damage the duck domino. Uh, I don't really think that it's worth it, in my opinion. But, hey. Whatever works for you guys, right? Uh, dodge, dodge, dodge. Ducky, ducky. Nice! Hey, man, we leave with as much health as we came in with, and I'm totally fine with that as a as a rule of thumb, man. If I come in with as much, if not more, than I let, I came in with, if I leave with as much as I came in with, I'm fine with it. <sighs> but now we can skip, if I can get the right rolls, if I can do three, hmm, se I might do seven. Three and one would be great. Three, 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 perfect. Man, sometimes the rolls are great. Now I can do one, and then I'd be home free. One, 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 two! Uh, either way, I'm fine with it. Two is the easiest boss in this run, or in, the, in this row, so that's fine with me. The um, eight ball's not hard, so we can do eight ball. <laughs> Please don't take that out of context. We can finish the eight ball off. <laughs> and a little tiny step to the side, and come on in, cue ball. I love that they're all themed. I think the fact that they're themed is the coolest part about all these boss runs. It's like, he's clearly a little pool ball, and he's got pool cues all around him, and I think that's awesome. And we're through. I should be able to, I might be able to take him out here really quick. Woo! Sneaky snacks. That should be it. I love that he barfs out the black. All right, now let's focus and actually get the rolls that we need to get. Because if I can do that, then we have four for King Dice and a super full. That's great. I can't believe, um, can't believe we came so close that first time. And we lost. All right, we need two and two. Two, two. Give me the dice. Two, 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 two. Oh, three. No! No, three. All right, well, I've got to get the right rolls then. I need three, 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 three. Perfect. All right, now I need a two. Don't even think too far ahead. Just a two. Just a two. Two, 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 two or three. I got to fight another boss. Kind of suboptimal, honestly. Well, I'm taking the long winding journey through King Dice and I don't like it. <sighs> King Dice. Alright, at least it's this guy. We can do this guy in our sleep, I say, as I'm going to get hit by him. Okay, okay, okay. And jump through. Perfect. I should probably just pop my super so I can just get through him faster. Less threat of losing health. Health is the thing that I need to keep, not my super. Super I can get back, dude. Okay, okay, okay. And the pink carries. You love to see it. You love to see it. We dash through the skulls, and we come right back to the card. We're pretty close already with supers. That's great. All right, perfect. We didn't do it great with our rolls, but we're getting through the bosses all right. <laughs> Why am I so bad at the rolls today? Uh, that's funny. Man, I guess it's not really that funny because I'm struggling up. I'm, I'm hooning up the gaff. <laughs> uh, two... And then two again. Two, 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 two. All right, and then two again. We can't start over again, which is nice. Two, 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 two. Oh, we're just bruising. Now I just need a two or a three. I'm fine with that. Uh, let's do two. Two, two, two. And then we just need one more two. We've gotten all the twos we possibly could want in our lives. So let's have one more two. Two, 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 two! Hey, here we go. Ready? Ready? Okay. And how did I get hit by the cards? Bolt. And get ready for his hand again. Here he comes. Oh, rude. Just two health left. Alright, ready? One, two, three! 
Ooh. Yeah! King dies! Take it, brother. He's hard. It's one of those things where, like, his boss fight just has so many different, like, layers to it. Like, he's not that hard as a boss, but by the time you get to him, you're just kind of tuckered out and you've been fighting so much. You're definitely not getting the time bonus on this one. <laughs> definitely not getting the time bonus on that. <sighs> oh, yeah, I only had uh, two out of three. But still, that's what? A? Yeah, we'll take an A on King Dice. He's a little bit of a trickster. He's a trickster, that King Dice. Um... Yeah, I took a long winding route with that one where I had went all the way back to the start. But hey, man, it's uh, it's fun to check out some of the mini bosses because they're really fun. And then there was one, the last, last boss in the main game, the devil. I don't know if y'all are ready. I don't think I am, but here we go. I haven't fought the devil in a while because the devil went down to Georgia. He's looking for a soul to steal. Well, well, well. Look how far you've come. Not only did you bust up my good-for-nothing lackey king dies, but I see you got my soul contracts as agreed. Hand them over and join my team. You literally can do that and end the game. Lame. No. Well, chin on me just like all the others, eh? I'll teach you for backing out of a deal. Have at you. All right, devil. Let's see what you got then, friend. Goat hands? Goat hands. And goat hands. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, parry! We parry and we go through. I love it. And goat hands. Goat hands. <laughs> you know, man, whatever works for you, right? Mine is, my trick is you say what he's doing. Just gotta say the things he's doing and you'll get through it. Spider face. Keep on whacking him. Heck yeah, goat hands, goat hands! <laughs> Come on, man, jump out. Ooh, 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 balls. Ooh, balls are going bananas. I could have parried that pink one, but I didn't do it. Sue me, dude. All right, he's going skelly. He's oh, that ball was still good? Rude. All right, this is where stuff gets insane, by the way. Ooh, poker chips. Ooh, explosive. Okay. Ooh, poker chips. Let's go ahead and drop this ult. So we can just get it out of our systems. Axe. He's asking us a question. He's asked us too many questions. Oh, bomb. Bomb's over there, though. Oh, I thought I could parry the bomb. No, God! All right, devil. Let's see what you got then, friend. Ooh, I don't love that that just spawned right on top of me. Pink. And we're through. Nice. Goat hands. Goat hands. Ah. And there you go. Okay, spider. Just start sending these out as soon as you can to make as much of a damage web as you can at the bottom. Because he will spawn, or he will, he kind of stays down there for a second. You can hit him a couple times. No thanks. Goat hands. Oh, I jumped early for goat hands. Just enough time for goat hands. No thanks. Okay, 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 okay. I hate the bubbles. These are truck. Oh, they're tough. Oh, my lord, my lord, my lord, my lord. Man, he's tricky. Okay, he's dragging him. I feel like he's... We're going to end up doing a little extra damage to him because I think we were like one hit away from his animation. Uh, breaking there. There we go. Here's his, here's the thing. And let's go down. And get ready to drop an ult quickly on this boy. Ulting. Love it. That's awesome. Okay, axe. Axe through. And then bomb. Purples. Love it. We're getting fast. Fast like a nice car. Like a nice car, baby. Anyone from the Bay Area feels me on that one. Oh! Holy frijoles. Holy frijoles. Man, that was spicy. That was spicier than it needed to be, dude. Let me get you down. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, hold up. Let's pop this. Shaklow him down. Oh, yeah, perfect. Right before that phase. I love that. Oh. Oh. Dude, we perfected him. Heck yeah. I might get an A plus on the devil. Oh, that was so cool. 
Damn, I get an A plus on the devil. That sentence is hilarious. Uh, ooh, HP, Perry, baby, I, you're watching it live and happening, baby. A plus, a perfect score on the devil. Dude, that's awesome. Oh, that gets me pumped up, dude. Pumped up. Ugh. It's the end of the game. Well, not really, because we have the DLC to go. The brothers had triumphed over the demon, forcing him to finally give up. We shall accept your surrender, devil, Cuphead laughed, but we're not done just yet. And with that, Cuphead and Mugman destroyed all of the soul contracts. <laughs> Releasing Inkwell Isle's residents from eternal servitude to the devil. Gosh, I can't wait to tell everybody, Cuphead said. The boys set off for home, and at top speed. Come on, last one there's a leaky cup, Mugman teased as they ran. Once home, the brothers gathered everyone together. You all freed the devil's debt, Cuphead announced. And that friend, and that fiend won't bother us again, Mugman added. The Elder Kettle was literally brimming with pride as everyone began to cheer. Let's hear it for Cuphead and Mugman. Hip hip hurrah! Hip hip hurrah! I love that all the enemies we fought are our friends now! As an all-day celebration began, the brothers promised to never wander into trouble again. And they didn't. Until the next time, of course. That is another story. The end, dude! Oh, I love this game. Uh, uh, critical notes? None. It's a beautiful game. Everything about it is fantastic. Our sincere appreciation to the members of our team whose loyalty and creative endeavor made possible this production. Legitimately, Cuphead. If you haven't played it before, it is such a delight to play through. I cannot recommend this game enough. Legit, like... Everything about this game is so fun, from the animation styles, it was painstakingly animated, to the enemy techniques and just the boss creation, the weapons and the movesets. I mean, everything about this game is so fun. I love this game. Um, yeah, you can do it as Cuphead or Mugman, which is fun. You can do both styles now. When the free game first came out, you can only play it as Cuphead. Um, and they quickly allowed you to switch over to Mugman. Uh, I've done all of the extra achievements in the main game, so I won't be doing those. Uh, but I will go through a good chunk of the DLC achievements, just because it's going to happen naturally anyways. Um, and I might... I mean, I'll probably end up finishing the achievements on my own time, but I won't make a video out of that because that just seems like... I don't know if you guys really want to see that stuff. Um, if you do, let me know if you want to know how to do the achievements, tricks for getting them faster, I'm happy to do that because I do love achievement hunting. Um, but Cuphead, what is there to say about it, really? Like, the first island is such a delightful little uh, introduction to what the game is and what it brings to you. World 2, they ramp up the difficulty just enough where you feel like you're starting to learn a little bit more and you're starting to experiment a little bit more with your weapons and your skill sets, just to the point where, like, it feels rewarding to beat each boss, and especially on your first playthrough, you are definitely going to have some struggles. Like, don't get this, don't let this streamline playthrough fool you. Like, these bosses are hard, and it takes time to learn their movesets. Um, I tried to give you guys tips along the way with how to beat certain bosses. The dragons, once again, those are a hard stop. Um, most people have a really, really hard time with the dragons in World 2. Um, but yeah, with the Lobber, they're really not that bad. It does take patience. And that's kind of the same with every single piece of these kinds of games, is the more patient you are, the better you are at them. I just want to take a second to verbalize how amazing it is to have a game that's hand-drawn and animated so beautifully. A game that went back to roots so intensely with, you know, this animation style, the because it's rubber hose animation, which is like classic animation style, and then going all the way to the music and the musicianship that is in this game, which is top notch, by the way. Um, all of the musicians who worked on this game are so talented from creative direction, art direction and music. This this game is a seamlessly enjoyable delight, really. Every single thing in this game was so beautifully thought through and so beautifully created that you really can't go wrong with it. And I'm terrified 
play the DLC? Because I haven't really heard anything about it. I have intentionally avoided the bosses. Um, and it's just going to be such a fun thing to do. But this game was a, a labor of love. That's all there is. And to there see it, to see it come to such a beautiful fruition is, or is they? amazing. <laughs> if you haven't played this game, I could not recommend it enough. This is the best game I've played in a long time. And it's a good time, baby. So thank you guys for coming along with me on this awesome journey. And I hope to see you guys in the next episode in the DLC. But I'll, uh, I'll see you guys there. Peace! We're getting glorious. We're getting up to mischief. Don't wait, cause we're coming in hot. Let's eat some biscuits. Let's get glorious. Glorious. Mischief.